channel and welcome to day 16 of Diva Log 2020 and for today's video I'm gonna be sharing some winter hacks with you guys and winter is already around the corner and I just thought of sharing it with you guys because it is going to be a very useful video and I have included hacks related to makeup, skincare and hair care so yeah if you're interested then please keep on watching and without any further ado let's just get started. My first hack is going to be related to your hair. So in winters, your hair tends to get really, really dry and along with your hair, your scalp also tends to get very dry and a little bit on the itchier side. And I feel that in winters, the problem of dandruff increases to a certain extent as compared to the other climatic conditions. So I have a hair oil for you guys that will take care about providing extra moisture to your hair and also it will take care that your scalp does not have any dry flakes or dandruff. So what you have to do is mix coconut oil, castor oil and a few drops of tea tree oil in it. You can add a couple of drops or maximum 4 drops of tea tree oil in it and that's it. Apply this oil all over your scalp and your hair and just leave it on overnight and wash it off the next morning. And when you are applying hair oil, make sure that you have heated the hair oil. Like you don't have to heat it so much but just warm it up a little bit and then apply it on your scalp so that your scalp will be able to just absorb all the nutrients and all the nourishment from the hair and the next morning you will be left with soft shiny and silky hair so the second hack is about your makeup so in winters your makeup tends to get crease very easily and you have that dry patches on your skin already so that will create a cakey effect of your makeup so to prevent that what you have to do is mix a little bit of facial oil in your foundation so now if you're not having any facial oil you can also go ahead and mix your moisturizer that you're using on daily basis in winters just mix that moisturizer in your foundation and you will be good to go it will provide that extra moisture that your face needs and your makeup will not look cakey and you will not have the dry patches when you apply your makeup my third hack is using rice water as an after rinse for your hair. So your hair is already lack of moisture and you're having so much of dandruff on your scalp. So rice water is going to take care of all these things and trust me rice water is the best thing that you can use on your hair and your hair is going to thank you for using rice water on your hair. Trust me just use it and experience the results yourself and then share the results in the comments down below. My next hack is about your skin. So in winters your skin tends to get very very dry no matter what skin type you are having and because of the dry skin you tend to have dry patches and on those dry patches your skin color tends to get a little bit darker than your normal skin color. So for these dry patches what you can do is regular scrubbing your skin. So you can use any scrub that is available in the market or if you want to prepare your own DIY scrub then what you can do is take powdered sugar and coffee and mix it in a paste with coconut oil and scrub your whole body with this. Trust me it is an amazing amazing scrub that you can use for your skin and just give it a try and you don't have to worry about any dry patches and discoloration on your skin. My next hack is about your dry and chapped lips. One thing that is very common and what you have to do is apply a lip balm every 2-3 to three hours. So by doing this you will always have a lip balm on your lips and there is no question of getting dry or chapped lips. And one thing that you can do is apply ghee on your lips every night before you go to sleep. And trust me no matter how dry and chapped your lips have become ghee will be able to cure any of these things and one more trick I have for you guys is regular scrubbing of your lips. So for scrubbing your lips you can use the scrub that you have prepared earlier the coffee and the sugar scrub you can use it on your lips also and if not this scrub what you can do is take a towel or a napkin and just dry scrub your lips with the napkin and you will be good to go. Do this for a couple of minutes and that's it you will be good to go no more dry and chapped lips. My next hack is also related to your skin and it is steaming your face. So when you steam your face, your face will become so much soft and so much supple and 
After steaming your face, when you apply a moisturizer, the moisturizer will be able to penetrate deep into your skin because your pores are open when you steam your face. And also, now your pores are open, you can also just remove the blackheads from your face. And that is like two in one hack. You can provide the skin with the extra moisture nourishment that it needs. Like the moisture is going to penetrate deep into your skin and you're removing your blackheads also. So make sure that you're steaming your face. My next hack is about face shaving. So for all you guys who think that your hair growth is not going to be soft again after you end up shaving for once, this is a myth guys. Have you heard that when you cut your hair from the bottom and the hair that grows from inside does not grow of the hair texture that you're already having? So when you shave your face or when you shave your body, you are shaving off the upper layer of your hair and the inner growth is not getting disturbed when you shave your face. If you are worrying about the inner hair growth and you know worrying about the fact that your hair growth is not going to be as soft as it was before then that is not a thing that you need to be worrying about. So go ahead and shave your face. It is so much easier and pain free. So what I prefer in winters is that I apply coconut oil so that it moisturizes my face and then the shaving process is a lot more smoother and easier as compared to dry shaving and yeah that's it for today's video i really really hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful and if you did then please don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel if you already haven't and also press on the bell icon so that you do not miss on any upcoming videos i'll see you tomorrow until then bye